Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. I am Cremel of House of Cremel. If you've never been here, welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today I will be doing a, I won't say huge, but a toddler boy haul. So if you are a boy mom and you just love spoiling your little baby or you don't and you just want to buy him something special, stay tuned. This is the video for you. Um, holidays are coming up. These babies have to get dressed. They need outfits. And I mean, you got to shop. In particular, my son's birthday is in, um, now it feels like a few days, but it's in about a week and a half. And my husband and I have just been doing a lot of shopping for him. Um, I will say this haul is very heavily clothing based. My son, is, he'll be two, so he does play with toys, but I try not to over inundate the house with a bunch of toys, at least while he can't ask for them right now. <laughs> but I do try to buy good things that I know will last long, and you know, um, I try to buy things that have a really high play value. So it may be one or three things, but there's lots of parts to them, and there's lots of fun attached to them. And also, let's be real, he got grandparents. And they're going to spoil him also. So, without further ado, let's get into the haul. So, the first store I'm going to show you that I got things from um, is a place that I've never shot before. It's only a couple things. But I went to Zara's website. I actually used to shy away from Zara's site because, I mean, the site is beautiful. But it's not that intuitive when you're doing it on your phone. And it's just kind of difficult to shop. So I always get turned off because I couldn't just search for what I wanted. Because I don't know. But this time I really tried because I really wanted to get my son some things from there. So I did get a couple pieces. I got these very fun leggings. I love the art on them. It kind of reminds me of like Basquiat or Picasso type art. Just really fun, like out of order, but not really just giving that real creative vibe. So they do classify them as leggings on the website, but I mean, they're just cotton pants. Any child could wear them. I also got these black joggers. I thought these were super modern, super sleek and cool. I really kind of go for a trendy-ish vibe, but not so trendy. I like classic things for my son. I like to create a little mini so to speak so i thought these were just perfect i love the little detail with the zipper on the side here and just the tapered legs if you can kind of tell i mean how cute is that on a little person and then this is actually my favorite it's the simplest of them all but zara actually has a line um i can't remember what it's called i'll put the name of it at the bottom of the screen but you can actually customize a a sweatshirt a hoodie and I believe some pants so I chose to get my son's name on this simple but cute sweatshirt it's like a brick color and you'll see I have his name um there it is embroidered on there and I actually didn't ex I expected it just to be kind of screen printed but it's embroidered so you only have a certain amount of characters there isn't an extra fee for it and it actually came within maybe a couple days after me ordering it. So it's not this long lead time either. So that's a really cool idea for anybody. Customization, I mean, I love it. If I send him to daycare with this, they'll even know that it's his already. I don't have to put his name on it. So that is what I got from Zara. The next store that I'm gonna show you things from are Nordstrom Rack. Guys, do not sleep on Nordstrom Rack. I know it's a lot to sift through sometimes, but a lot of times the stuff in Nordstrom Rack is absolutely worth it. Um, I didn't get too much there, but I was able to find a couple things. I bought him some little Crocs, which I don't have over here for right now. He's been wearing them. It's gotten a lot cooler here, but I, we just slipped the Crocs on when he's at home. I'll insert some footage of him walking around in them. It's the cutest little thing. But um, we got some Crocs there for a pretty good price. We needed some tennis shoes that he could wear to daycare that he could just mess up because... I mean, when he goes to daycare and comes home, I'm always like, did you step in everybody's lunch? Did you roll in the cheese puffs? Like, what's going on? 
So we needed to get some like nice leather shoes that were just pretty durable that we could clean easily. So we found these really cute Adidas with the Velcro. He actually has a white pair of shell toes that are very similar to this. But, you know, it's just simple. They call it Grand Court, the three stripes. They look cute with a lot of outfits. Very versatile. And I also found two pieces by a line called Sovereign Code. Sovereign Code Kids, I loved how soft these were. I could tell they were pretty good quality. We'll see how well they wash, but this is kind of a, is this a raglan sleeve? No, it's a regular sleeve, but it has like, it's not, it's not a, a short sleeve, but it's not a long sleeve, but it's also not a three quarter sleeve, but it'll probably hit him right below his elbow. But I just loved this little simple stripe. And my husband loves to put our baby in a Henley because he wears them all the time. I told you, that's his our little mini. So we got that, and this is also by Sovereign Code. It's just a cute color block tee, I meant hoodie. A cute color block hoodie. So you have the light neon color blocking with the faded black over the heather gray. I love this. Very, very soft. I used to work for a really great um, Elevated Basics company, so I really get into how soft fabrics are. And um, this passed the test. So that is what I got him from Nordstrom Rack. All right. So these next two are bigger hauls. Um, hold. False alarm. This one isn't the larger one. This one actually just got like one set of things. My husband loves Nike. I told you guys that we love to dress him as a little mini sometimes. And Nike is one of my husband's favorite favorite brands so it was only right that he bought him a nike sweatsuit this is just a i'll take it out the packaging this is a hoodie and some matching sweatpants real very classic nike so here's the sweatpants he's gonna be so cute we just kind of always we have always kept nike for him so it was time to size up and this is the hoodie, just a simple black hoodie with the two-tone Nike logo. And what's a Nike fit without matching shoes? So my husband was a huge fan of the, which one are these? The Nike Blazers, the mid-height, um, however you say it for shoes. But these are so cute, y'all. A little baby in these, like, come on. These are too cute. And they're like an easy... um put on so these aren't real shoestrings they just look like it and you can just pull the whole front part up like some adults need this let's be real especially for the hirachis come on nike anyway but um and then you can just slip their foot in there and then just as easily velcro it back and you got a cute shoe so love this and love that little feature also, forgive me if I'm rushing. My husband went to go pick up my son from daycare and I'm trying to beat him. I have all this stuff laid out on the couch and if he sees it, he's going to swipe it off. So let's keep going. All right, so the next haul is a little larger. We went to Old Navy and went kind of crazy. I kid you not, we were in there maybe 20 minutes. Spent maybe $150 and $150 in Old Navy money is pretty good. <laughs> So I start with these cute socks we got. I just love these. They were all these cute fall colors and patterns. So, and all of these were pretty much the color scheme of the items that I picked to purchase for him. Yep, here they come. All right, so I got him this cute NASA t-shirt. I love these NASA t-shirts and any of them like them. It's kind of like inspirational and kind of educational. You know, that kind of, what do you call it? I don't know. So be an astronaut undertone I don't know <laughs> found this oh my goodness you guys this is so soft but it's like a, a loose waffle knit thermal t-shirt long sleeve and a burnt orange color you'll pop you will probably be able to find all of these on all Navy's website I'll do my best to link everything below some soft orange jogger pants thought those were cute all right, so I did kind of a coordinated thing. I bought a couple of um, flannel um, long sleeve button downs to go with some long sleeve shirts to do some kind of layering. So I got this orange logo graphic tee, real cute. 
And I also got it to go with this flannel. It's like an orange, navy blue, and teal color. You guys can probably hear them coming in the house on the inside. So yeah, so I'll probably put it over this and like kind of layer it. So you see it's cute. Then I got this other, what does this say? Rexcellent graphic long sleeve tee. You guys, I usually don't go for this kind of stuff, but I thought this was kind of cute because it's just at the chest and not all over the shirt. So thought it was still cute. <laughs> I got this long sleeve. It says family, what does it say? Family sticks together. Hi, dog. Oh, okay. It's okay. <laughs> hey. Hey. This is a real moment, guys. It is. Yeah, let's hope. <laughs> let's hope. Boogie is seeing all his birthday stuff. He's never paid attention to it in oh, the office. Oh, we came at the perfect time. Look at Boogie. Oh, Lord. Oh, God. All right, we're going to try to get through this fast, y'all. And I bought another green and navy long sleeve flannel to go with this one. And then, last one from Old Navy. My husband picked out this really cute tie-dye outfit. He has awesome taste. <laughs> yeah. I might, ask, might I add? Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry guys, real moment happening here, but these are like tie-dye pants mm -hmm. and a long sleeve Henley again, so he can wear this in the house. He can wear it to bed if he wants to, but, and we can use them as separates, but this was super cute. If you can't tell, I love for my baby to be pretty, really, really comfortable. So, and he's tough and moves around a lot, so I don't like for him to wear a lot of rigid clothes. All right, guys, sorry. Um, second to last part of the haul. Excuse my son if you hear him in the background. <laughs> so I got, this actually came together. This next haul is from H&M. It's one of my favorite places to shop for my baby. He's a big boy now, y'all. He's hardly a little baby. <laughs> But this came together, so it was a it's another graphic tee flannel shirt combo. So this got this is like a Colorado. What does it say? Camp Burrell, sorry. But I love the graphic tee and the flannel shirt that goes over. So it's like a navy and gold. Then we have some long sleeve, more Henleys. These are, um, one is darker brown and one is lighter brown. I bought some short sleeve versions of these for him in like navy blue and um, cream before. Love them, I think they look so cute. So I bought two more but long sleeve versions. So he'll just be able to wear this with some jeans or some pants, whichever we choose. All right, then I bought him a set of sweatpants, different colors. So we have a light tan. Keep in mind, it's got it's that jogger fit. Let's see. And got these in blue also. These are like regular pockets. And then I have two, one in green and one in blue with kangaroo pockets. So oh my gosh, and this is one of my favorite guys. Huh, I love a good fox. Bookie has foxes randomly everywhere in his room. Right now, there's no rhyme or reason to them, but if I see them and I think they're cute, I always get them. It's been that way since he was a little, little baby. So any way I can bring the fox and age it up, I do it. So I got him this matching set. So there's this, got a flocked fox on the front of this long sleeve shirt. It's more like a soft French terry. So, well, it's not French Terry. It's like a thin fleece. But, um, and it's got like a flocked fox. You can see kind of the texture. So cute. And then it's got some matching pants with foxes on the knees or just below the knees. So, I know this is a bit more baby-like for him. But, I mean, I couldn't help it. I love it. He's going to pull it off. So cute. And then I got him this tonal jogging suit. It's like a light brown with some texture details on the sleeves. Can you see it? It's like some ribbing. Can you see it? There you go. Um, and on the front pocket here, there's some ribbing and it is a hoodie and he has matching pants that also have 
a ribbed detail at the bottom of it. So that is what we got him from H&M. That is all the clothes, guys. I'm so excited to get him in these. I'm kind of, we're going to open them on his birthday or for his birthday um, celebration. And uh, yeah, so the last and final part of the haul are going to be toys. And I'll tell you a little bit about why I chose them. So the first thing. All right, so I am big into toys that my baby can learn from or promote or um, what is it? grow his fine motor skills or anything that will help him reach those reach and grow those milestones so i got him this is this is by b toys um pound and play it's a shape sorter basically and my son is really starting to recognize his shapes and really learning how to play with these these types of toys so i thought it would be a good idea to get this for him and basically the shapes are long you put it through the matching um hole cut out and you pound it in simple as that so i think he's gonna love this all right the next thing is a bath toy so my son is starting to get very active in the bathtub he loves to play like so i want to kind of keep him active and keep the play contained in the bathtub as much as i can anyway so i got him this this is by you kiddo um celebrate and discovery and it's a sip and sprinkle water lab so it's kind of like science you know but in the bathtub so he can pour things this part spins he loves things that spin so i think you yeah you attach it onto the tub and you pour water and make things happen so i got this from target all of these toys came from target by the way He's going to love this. He kind of low-key discovered it when he walked in the door. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. This is the big one. Remember when I was telling you we don't like to buy him a lot of things, but I like to buy things that have a lot of play value? Um, this is one of those things. So, this is <laughs> a Fisher Price. Let me lower the camera so you can see it. This is a Fisher Price, who, what do you call it? Laugh and learn, grow the fun, garden to kitchen, play set. So basically there's two sides to this. There's like a garden side and there's a kitchen side. I think he wants to come in here. Sorry if y'all hear him yelling. But he can pretend to grow things in a garden, then come in and pretend to cook them on the other side in the kitchen. I thought this would be great because, I mean, I feel like I'm going to have fun with this with him. And he's going to have fun in it. So, he may not play with everything correctly, by the way, by right away. But I feel like it's something me and my husband will enjoy playing with him. And we it can grow with him. And he can learn how to do all the stuff. And we can do some very rich pretend play with it. So, it was between this and they have a food truck version. Uh, we, I went back and forth on that one, guys, because it's kind of the same concept. And, I mean, the only reason we didn't do the food truck was because I was like, maybe we should promote healthy eating since we're trying, making an attempt <laughs> to do that ourselves. Like, it will be like a nice reminder. Maybe not grow your own food because we don't have a garden, but buy some produce. I don't know. <laughs> but that is it, guys. So, that's it. If you needed some ideas for some upcoming gift giving for a toddler boy, these are it. Um, of course, there's much more um, out there. And, you know, as I do more shopping, especially since when we start to get into Christmas shopping, I will share that with you guys. That's it for the video. You guys, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Share, share, share with someone who has any kind of kid it doesn't matter and anyone that you might be interested in this content thank you so much for coming and especially if you got to this part of the video i appreciate you talk to you guys later bye